Alrighty, here we are, and I am done filling in all this area, so let's go another ladder there, and so yeah, this is how you get up into the attic. It's up this ladder here. Except the attic is extremely lame right now. And therefore how are we gonna do this? I know how we're gonna do this. Should we use stairs? We should use stairs, right? Yes. Right? No. Yes. Yes. Mm-hmm. Okay, well. Let me put stairs there. Blocks there. Stairs. Blocks. Stairs. Now let's just do this. Go this way. And you want to make sure that it's not angled, like when you get up here. Okay, wait. So that's just two, right? So we can just do this. Make it nice and pointy. So I'm thinking we should just keep it like this, and so it it is another one of those like little indentation things. Uh, let me go down there and show you guys what I'm talking about. Just jump down up there. See, it looks better when it's like that. It's kind of like up here how we have that thing. How it's like kind of indented. Mm, but yes, so let's get back up there. Here we are, up here. And now for the pretty annoying part. I don't know, I'm just kind of figuring out how we're, how we're going to do this. This is going to be the other, like, main part of the roof. Oh, but first, you know what? Let's have, like, an attic window. That's a thing, right? An attic window. A little tiny attic window. Just a small one. And so, yes, and so now over here, you're going to do blocks. It's like a huge scale version of what we just did, and I fell. Get back up here. Um, how am I going to do this? Because when I put it there, it just looks weird right there. So that one should just be a normal block. I see, and then this one's going to be a normal block. Okay, I get how this works now. Yes, how to make a house look good. How to make a house look good 101. And now I can just kind of do this, because the way stairs work, it's just the angle that you're closest to. You don't have to be, like, straight on placing it. If you're placing it, like, at this angle, then it's going to orient that way. Like, if I'm, facing, if I'm placing it, like, from here, it's going to be fine. But if I'm placing it like that, it's not just whatever angle you're closer to. So, I'm going to do one more layer of this and then I will go and then cut out doing this exact same thing on the other side. Okay, so let's see. The way I had it going was that I had blocks under each stairs. So I kind of want to keep that. Like, this is a stair, right? Yeah, that's a stair. So, I'm going to keep having the one block under each stair kind of thing. Don't need those blocks. Not sure why they're there. We do need those blocks, though. Um, yeah, I'm going to have one block under each stair just because that's what I've been doing, and that's how it's going to look nice. Wait, is this a block? That's a normal block. So that's going to be a normal block. You see how easy this is? All right, so I'm going to do the exact same thing that I just did over here. I will be right back for that. Alright, and here we are. I finished the roofish part, the front part, kind of. So, I'm just, like, checking, because I did have, like, a stair, just right there. Or, like, facing that way from the original other triangle way. So, yeah, the roof, it does look really good. I saw it from down there. But now, what you're going to want to do... Uh, you're just going to want to fill this whole thing in. And then maybe we'll go out one layer with the stairs, like out again on the outside, but I don't know about that. 
but yeah, anyway, so we still do need to get the uh, stairs up even higher. And so now, since we have surpassed where that little triangle was... How did I determine where that triangle was? Let's see. Let me just fly for a sec. How did I determine where it was? See, I kind of want it to be bigger, but I don't want it... Yeah, we kind of do need it to be bigger. No, it's fine, it's fine. What if I did that? That looks good too. It's like glass panes in a way, how it's like in a little bit, but yet it's still a glass block. So, let's get on. So see, it does actually look pretty nice. Let's get off the fly mod. Cheating. Mm, yeah, so pretty much, uh, it's kind of hard to find out, like, how it's going to work. So normally when I think that I'm getting near the middle, I just go and I start doing the other side. And then I just kind of like, can see when they get really close. But, so yeah, now let's go work on the other side. So this is just kind of going to be like a basic roof kind of thing. The gay thing is, like, if you're standing on the bottom half of the stair, oh, never mind. Okay, then. Whatever, in multiplayer it acts weird. But, you know, just kind of same thing, same thing, like stairs and then wood blocks in front of all of them. I'll be right back when I have gotten about that high, like four or five layers ish. Okay, so I'll be back one second. Okay, guys, I'm back, and so I finished the front stairs, and I did the back stairs. I did not do the sides, but I kind of did change around quite a bit of stuff with the front. So let's just uh, jump off the house here. Basement is still not done. We're gonna need to do that, but I made there be three things going up, like three big triangles. I made two bigger ones simply because it just, like, the one small one, I just didn't like it. But, one second, let me fly up on here. I'm just seeing something that I don't like right now. Everything else is all curved, except for this. So let's do that, and it looks a lot better, right there. And you know what else we should do? We should put logs across here. Am I right? Log is just kind of used to accent it, make it stand out a bit. And you know what I'm thinking? We should put logs around all the windows. I mean, like, that's what, that's what I sometimes do, but, but yeah, I don't know, I don't know. I am putting logs in here, because, I mean, you can still put two and two together, so you just see it from the outside. I'm just gonna go through it, like all the windows in the house pretty much and put logs around them. I mean it looks good, I think, right? So okay, yeah, I'll be right back. I'm just gonna fly around and put logs on everything. Yeah, you know what, let's not do that. That does it does not look that good. So anyway, um up at the top the roof it kinda needs to be accented more, I think. I mean we're gonna need to do something with the outline of that. But for now let's fly up into here. See the roof looks pretty good in my opinion. And it's finished, so now I just need to fill in this area. This is, you know, just to the side. So, I'll be right back when I'm done this. And here we are, and it is pretty much done, you know. The attic, I think it's done, I might say that much, like the actual attic. But outside, I wouldn't say so much, because we need to really, like, indent that. I'm just going to finish that up really quick for this episode. And I'll see, uh, trying to think on what I should do. I could just do logs around the border of them all, like logs. Like that, kind of. Yeah, you know what, let's do it. Okay. Uh, I am going to put logs. Oh, never mind, because they're stairs. Hmm. We'll leave it for now. 
So yeah, any guys, anyway guys, um, thanks for watching. Uh, comment, rate, and sub. It really helps me out. It does. Um, anyway, so, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. But, um, just on another note, you guys should check out my custom map that I made. Um, it's called Chunk Survival for now. But, um, the basically the way it is, um, almost every single chunk is gone. It's kind of like there's a bunch of random chunks. And, yeah. Like, you start on your spawn chunk, and then you can build bridge to other chunks, and the spawn chunk is like a basic, it has basic stuff, like there's a tree and stuff. But, and then, yeah, and then it's like a full chunk, like 16 by 16 by 64, and then you end up building bridges and go to other chunks, and there's secrets, and there's, it's pretty cool, it's pretty cool. So check it out, link will be in the description for that. Thanks for watching, guys.